Michael Jackson, the, the game was tied 7-7 at the half, and you were able to open up and find that huge pass downfield that set up the touchdown. It was the separation. Just bring me into that play. Um, so it was a fake run, pulled it. The line did an amazing job of giving me time all night, and I knew my receiver cut back free, wide open, just had to give him a chance to go get it. We know that Beville likes to run the ball and kind of demoralize and push. You guys did the same thing back to them, had a huge runs in the second half. Just bring me into your rushing attack and how you were able to sustain that run. Yeah, so I tell the coaches, just let me run, let me do my thing. I trust my linemen and when I run the ball. I don't know, it's just, it's just an amazing feeling to go get them yards and get them touchdowns. We know that your older brother, JJ, knows what it's like to have success and head to the Dome. You're heading to the Dome now. Bring me into those emotions right now. Yeah, I mean, just celebrating with my teammates going to the Dome. Won't be my first time, yeah. but it's just the best feeling ever. Just going to play in the Dome, see all the college players play in there. There's just no other better feeling than that. Like you said, it hasn't been your first time, but does this one feel different at all? Yeah, there's definitely a bigger chip on our shoulder, especially because CBA is undefeated. Um, we're just going to have to go out and play our game, just trust each other stand by each of the teammates and just play our football. What was it about this game in the se in the first half that it was such a low-scoring affair, 7-7? Seven to seven? What were you seeing out there offensively? The DBs did a really good job of containing me in the first half. Um, we couldn't really get the pass game going. Run game wasn't doing very good. Had to punt a lot. So 7-7 seven, seven at half, and then the second half we just took off. And then we the, there was that one drive for Beville, multiple flags just kept going down and just bring me into you know looking looking at that and kind of what was going on from the sidelines when it was i believe 44 yards for yeah, a first down i mean you can just see everyone on their team get frustrated started to get down i think at that point is when we knew we won the game because we saw their coaches and players started to get down yell at each other that's when we knew we had the game what was it about this team this season that you feel like you've made it to the dome Definitely just leadership on both ends of the ball. Whenever someone gets down, there's always a teammate that gets that helps them get back up. Was there ever anything that kind of went into it? Did you guys buy into the hype at all? A lot of people preseason were saying CBA, CNS. Yeah. Did you think about that at all or no? I mean, yeah, we kind of expected it, but going into this game, we knew how tough of a battle it was going to be, and we knew that we had to play our best football. CBA, CNS is what it is in the JMA Wireless Dome. That last game against CBA, 42-41, to 41, what are your – biggest takeaways, memories from that that you're going to use as that chip on your shoulder, like you said? Yeah, we just got to keep the ball and drive down the field. Don't let them get too many opportunities on offense because you know how, how they do. And we just have to capitalize on every single drive and every single turnover we get. What do you want to say to North Star Nation for showing up tonight and showing up all season? That's right. Let's go to the dome, baby.